So the first card is um, uh, the bouquet. So some kind of gift coming in for you, some kind of unexpected opportunity or something that comes in uh, that makes you pretty happy. And it's, um, you know, it's almost like a gift from the universe for you. So there could be uh, that coming in for you. Now, you have been worried a lot about finances. You've probably been uh, spending a lot of um, you know, you might have had a lot of expenses that went out, uh, but so you've been, um, you know, you've changed the way you've been handling your finances and now you're into that saving mode. So where money was going out, you're now trying to close that cupboard and make sure that, you know, you are handling your finances um, quite carefully at the moment. Now you've got the tree over here. So whatever you've been doing as far as your work goes has been quite successful. You're slowly building up uh, your career over here and, you know, you're establishing your Yourself. Now, in the past, you've got the books that you might have been involved uh, with uh, learning or education or taking in some courses or some kind of seminar, uh, dealing with a lot of information over there with that uh, book card. Uh, you also received some kind of shocking news, some kind of um, maybe you un uh, had some kind of loss. Maybe this is why financial loss and maybe this is why you're having to watch your finances with this cupboard card over here. So there might have been some kind of financial loss in the recent past. Going into the future, you've got the rider card over here. So some a good news coming in and there's a new beginning as well. So you're going to start off something brand new, or maybe a new job or maybe you even start off in a new position. But there is some brand new, uh, some good news coming in about that. So those are the energies for that week or two weeks rather. Okay, so you've got this nine of um, rods over here. And this is a card about feeling very overwhelmed and feeling very oppressed in that particular position you are at, you know, almost as though people are tramping you down. So you are in a position where you're carrying a lot of responsibilities and burdens, but a lot of people making a lot of demands on you. You might be facing a lot of challenges at this particular moment, and you are feeling a bit uh, downtrodden, a bit uh, stressed and a bit overwhelmed as well in that particular position. Now, uh, success is coming to you. You've got the six of rods over here. So you will be uh, reaping some kind of harvest. So it looks like there's recognition coming in as well with that uh, six of rods. But also whatever you've been doing is going to have a good payoff. You will soon be able to reap the rewards of whatever you've done. So whatever time and effort you've invested in that particular job or project is going to be paying off very, very soon. You've got this two of cups over here. This is about having people around you that are very supportive and help you uh, get your balance back again. So these are good friendships with this two of rods, uh, two of cups over here. This is the yin yang quality. So this is about finding that balance. Um, this is also, um, you know, about, um, you know, getting that support that you need in order to bring that balance back in your life again. So if you're very, very stressed out, there is that need for you to go and take a little bit of a holiday, a little bit of a break so that you're not so stressed out and get your balance back as well with this uh, yin yang card. So, um, You've got the Ten of Rods over here, so it looks like, you know, uh, whatever situation you were dealing with that uh, held, you know, where you had to work really, really hard, uh, it looks like it's going to pay off because you, you've got these ships coming in over here, but it's the Ten of Rods, and Ten of Rods is about all those difficult difficulties, challenges, responsibilities that you were dealing with are now come to an end and now you will get that payoff. So whatever hard work you've put into this particular project is now the payoff is now coming uh, in for you. And, you know, it, it's still sailing in, but it is going to be coming in for you and you're going to be very, very happy because it's the, it's the end of all your difficulties that you've been through or, or the end of all those challenging situations. So there, it looks like there's some kind of offer that comes in for you with this four of cups over here. So it's a very stable offer, long-term offer. It might be something, uh, in, in a company or some kind of business or, or some kind of job that has been, uh, long, established. So, um, you know, um, this is a, a company that has got a good reputation or some, uh, it, you know, a very, very good post. Uh, and it's an offer that comes in for you. And it's also going to give you stability as well. 
you can see all these pillars standing upright carrying very very heavy loads over here so and they're standing the test of time so it looks like uh you know whatever this offer that is going to come in for you is going to bring you uh job stability uh, but also it's in a company that has been around for a long time it's it's a pretty good uh stable kind of job it's going to bring in that regular finance as well so you've got this knight of rods over here and you might be even thinking about moving to actually do this do a job. You might be thinking about traveling or relocating to actually do uh, a job. So maybe an offer is coming in from an international source and you're going to have to travel internationally. This is definitely meeting a lot of international people or making a lot of international contacts. So you've got this eight of uh, coins going into the future. So whatever you're uh, doing, uh, you know, uh, you need, to, there's some information, like I say with this card, that you need to actually get in order for you to get unstuck so you might be everything might seem to be at a standstill maybe you're waiting for information to come in as well and this is particular job that you do is going to require some further study as well so there's going to be some kind of apprenticeship uh, issue going on over there with that eight of coins um you know learning on the job and becoming an expert at whatever you're doing getting pretty good at it as well now you've got that nine of swords over here so wherever you are at you've been feeling a bit downtrodden uh, you know uh, you've been feeling a bit um as though people are taking advantage of you people are bullying you around um you know telling you what to do you know humiliating you or um you know you're telling you off You've got that nine of swords over here. So there's a lot of anxiety going on over here, but they're putting you down a lot. Uh, they're attacking your self-confidence as well. And maybe you don't have a lot of confidence at the moment. And there's that issue going on over there. And this is because people are being very critical and they're bullying you and bossing you around. Then you've got this temperance card over here. So this is showing that you need to get some advice uh, and get some balance back in your life over here. Um, you know, um, this is about taking all... Uh, that you've learned putting it into um you know blending it together and being able to sort through problems so you might need to get some advice and some help on what to do and how to proceed forward it might even be professional advice that you would need now you've got this five of so uh, five of coins over here so you're feeling a bit uh, lost, a bit isolated, a bit unsupported as well at this particular moment and this is causing a little bit of of upset for you and going into the future, you might be dealing with somebody that is very, very nasty. You're um, uh, a very challenging position um, or a very challenging person that you're dealing with. Maybe what it, what they're saying is quite nasty. You've got two fists. So you and this person are not really getting along, but this person uh, maybe puts you down. You know, this is the person that's telling you off all the time, um, maybe causing a lot of anxiety and stress. Maybe you're not even sleeping because this person's causing a lot of a drama in your life or presenting an obstacle they're preventing you from moving forward uh you know they are hindering your advancement as well there's some kind of decision as well with this two of swords that you have to make it might be uh you might even be waiting for some kind of official news you might need to make some kind of official decision but there's some kind of decision that you need to make and it needs to be based on logic so somebody's preventing you from moving forward uh, causing some kind of opposition and you're having to come against them you're butting heads with this person and uh you know it might be a communication issue that is going on over here now you will find the solution you've got three of cups over here you might need to actually uh, speak to some friends around you and they will provide the answer the key to open the door for you to move forward so there's some advice that you need from people that you work around some people that are supporting you they will give you a really good advice you need to follow that advice in order for you to move forward um, and to get out of this situation and you've got this king of uh, pentacles over here so this is getting into a position being offered a really good position over here uh, the money this is the money card so money coming in as well so once you're able to overcome uh, this opposition or, or overcome this person that's preventing you from moving forward it looks like you get into a good position a good management position and the money comes in and you will be uh you know it it, it provides some fina financial stability this is also a long-term job and like i said it's kind of a, a leadership position it might be involving uh, doing a lot of paperwork as well um 
you can see this man's working with a lot of paperwork, but also it might even be a, a job that involves working with money or managing time, managing people, uh, some kind of thing that involves financial management, or it could be something that involves financial calculations or something to do with, uh, you know, where you, you're working with figures, facts and figures, really, uh, with this king of pentacles. So this is a new job offer coming in. So once you get through this, make this decision, whatever this decision is, uh, with this two of swords over here, um, it looks like it opens the doors for you with this three of cups. And this, like I said, with three of cups, you do need to get some advice uh, to get that solution to that problem. And it, it will provide, you will get that particular post. It looks like it opens the door for you to get that particular job um, that you're looking forward to. So, um, and it's going to bring in a lot of money as well with that king of pentacles. So I'm just going to draw some cards for the um, fairy tarot. So you've got the two of summer over here, which says, um, don't give up. Uh, um, there is forgiveness and resolution of a problem and um, a relationship can be healed. So it looks like um, it also says about making a serious commitment to someone. So it looks like there is somebody around you that is going to be very supportive uh, because this is the two of summer, which is like the two of cups. And it looks like that person is going to be coming in to give you a hand to help you. Now, you've got the two of cups as well in the main read over here. So there is somebody that's very supportive that's going to help you get through this difficulty. You need to actually ask or take this person's advice. They're going to be able to bring that balance and bring that um, resolution of whatever problem that you're dealing with. So you've got the King of Spring over here, which says a financial windfall, a leadership skill. Your leadership skills are needed now, an unexpected supporter of your cause. So it looks like there's somebody coming in to give you a hand over here with this King of Spring. This also could mean a financial windfall, some money coming in as well, and a leadership position that you're going to be getting. And you've got that King of Pentacles over here, which is talking about a leadership position as well. Uh, and whatever your problem is, it looks like whoever it is is going to be there. Uh, to help sort it out as well. So you're going to be able to get out of, out of this problem because you are going to get the the support that you need. And then you've got that temperance card again, which is about balance. And this is take everybody's input into consideration, merge viewpoints to create a better solution and take your time. There's no need to rush. So you have got um, where did I see this? You've got that temperance card coming in over here as well. So you do need to take people's advice and, and um Look at everybody's opinions and make a decision of that. So you need to merge all those viewpoints, make a decision based on what everybody's uh, input is. Because people are giving you bits of information, maybe not all at once, but little bits of information that's going to allow you to get that problem sorted out. You see there's that big lion. So this person sorting this, um, this problem out and you're going to actually have to get some advice. Like I said, you might need some professional advice as well if necessary to get yourself sorted out but it looks whatever this problem is whatever you're dealing with at the moment there is somebody that that's going to be uh, supportive of you so this could be this king of spring who actually provides that support for you uh, because there's an unexpected supporter of your cause and it looks like you get uh, that leadership position coming in as well with that so there is some kind of decision pending somebody is causing some kind of problem for you, but it looks like eventually you end up in a leadership position uh, in both uh, the Oracle as well as the main spread. So, um, you know, just work on that confidence issue that you have. Try not to let get people get you down, even if you are feeling very, very downtrodden at this particular moment. Try and get that balance back with that yin-yang card. Whoever this person is that's going to support you uh, is, you know, follow their advice because it looks like very soon there's recognition and rewards coming your way. So I hope that this reading has resonated with you. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Leave me some comments if it has resonated. And thank you so much for watching. Take care now. Goodbye.